Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Black Candy. I'm Diana, but welcome to my channel, which is Sophisticated Divas. And for all of you new subscribers, thank you so much for joining me on my journey and um, what I am actually doing right now. I have been on a um, weight loss journey for the past five years, but now my journey has changed. I am now like on the maintenance side of my journey of um, maintaining and um, I'm now a personal trainer. Last week, guys, I did not make a video uh, running around. I do apologize for that. I am back. Um, I have actually been out of town. I have actually been running, really, really running, getting it. I have been popping up on people, running out of town, drove all the way back in um, this afternoon. And uh, then I had to get ready to start the squat challenge and film for that. I have done that. So the squat challenge is up. Make sure you guys go and take a look at the squat challenge video. Today is day one. We have 50 squats to knock out. And today's song request was lifestyle. So we did 20, 20, and 10. And we used 5 pound weights. But those of you that's first time starting, you can use 1, 2, or 3 pound weights. And uh, that was uh, something. I used the weights all the way through. Um, as we're doing the squats and just doing a little bit of movement a little bit. So anyway, welcome to the Squat Challenge if you guys are just now joining me. If you guys have been with me all along, thank you guys for coming back. And so now, um, uh, like I said, we did 50 squats and tomorrow we'll be uh, filming to my head. It's I am soaked. I am hot. So anyway, let's get on uh, to me um, and what I'm doing. Wait, first, 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 so let me go, let me go back because... Uh, I want to be right and about what I have been doing and my accountability. I have been being accountable for uh, my eating, except for uh, this weekend I had some drinks with my brothers and sisters and my brother-in-law and all that stuff right there. But throughout last week, I was accountable for my food and everything that I was eating and getting in my exercise. But I was not accountable for myself as in um, logging into the group Red Set Goal Challenge. Um, so I want to apologize to the girls for me not doing my part and being responsible and posting like I should. So therefore in all fairness I am no longer in the group. Not that I don't support the group because I support you guys 100% because you guys are actually hitting it and doing what you need to do to actually be successful um, for the goals that you guys have set forth for the 30 days but I still support you guys and um, I am thankful for the time that I actually was in there but still I'm still supportive of the whole thing so um, I just want to apologize for you, to you girls for me not doing my part um, and I don't want to give any excuses to you guys it's all fair across the board because if you don't do what you're supposed to do you're removed from the group so and I wasn't responsible for what I was doing so I have been removed from the group and like I said uh, it's by my own fault and my own doing for me not doing what I'm supposed to have been doing. Okay, again, I do apologize to you guys. I am so, so sorry. Um, but I am here for you guys. I'm still in it. You know, I'm still team with you guys. Um, this month, what I plan on doing is I am trying my hardest. My hardest. And which is going to be hard because I've been thinking about what I was going to do this weekend. I'm going to say this week. But... I am trying my hardest for this month to do no cardio. None. No cardio. Lifting all throughout the 30 days. And I am going to be doing the squats with the weights and everything. So I'm doing things a little bit different. And weights. Um, cardio, you know what I'm saying? Cardio gets a lot done though too. But weights burn more. And um, so that's what I'm going to be doing. You guys know I am into the toning phase of toning my body and all this stuff. I'm not going for the big you know, who are hard body thing. No, I want to be, uh, sexy. So, okay, now, when we talk about the sex part, let me talk about all this stuff, what I'm talking about. Sexy. Now, everybody says, you know, I want to lose weight. You know, I want to get skinny. I want to get skinny. You know what I'm saying? Let me tell y'all something. Skinny ain't it, okay? Skinny is no longer in. Uh, that's my opinion. I can say my opinion. My opinion. Skinny? Nah. Yeah, everybody wants to lose weight and you want to get smaller and all that stuff right there. I'm telling you what I like. I want to be small and I want to be defined. 
You hear me? I want you to see all the cuts. And so I don't want to be skinny. When you see my body and all that stuff, I want to be sexy and defined. Not skinny. You know what I'm saying? I want you to see where all, not this. No. You know what I'm saying? I want you to see, like if you do an outline. Let me show you. You do an outline. This shit right here. The damn stick man shit. Y'all see that? No, I ain't trying to get like that. Show y'all what I want. Okay. This gonna look crazy right quick, but damn that. This my damn stick man. Y'all see that? You know, my ass, my muscles, my curves and shit. That's that's what I that's the kind of damn stick man I want. I want you to see my muscles and all this stuff. I want to be defined because skinny ain't it. You know what I'm saying? You want to be sexy. Not damn skinny mm, drawn all in and stuff like that. I am happy with my weight. I am happy with my body. I like how I look. And now, you know, with this extra skin and all this stuff, you know, I'm taking the steps now to do what I need to do. What I am doing now, I was actually in a doctor's office and my body's actually being prepped for a procedure within the next six weeks. I am going from any little spot from head to toe working on my body. Right now, what I'm doing is I have a spot on my ear uh, from almost two years ago. This right here, I have a spot right there. You guys can see that. And it was from an earring. Um, a girl made a mistake in Walmart. And, um, yeah. It, and it kind of messed up my ear. And even when I have short hair, people could never, you know, tell it or whatever. Because, like, behind my ear. So, we are going through everything. Whatever I can see or whatever that I like. I'm trying to actually get my body the way that I like it. So, this is the first thing right here. We were going to do everything together. As in with uh, my tummy tuck and all this stuff. But... We're going to go ahead on and start now because I'm going to have to go through so many treatments. With my tummy tuck, well, at first right now, I have to go through um, six injections. First, I'm going to be getting three injections in my ear every two weeks. Then they'll do the procedure to actually to uh, remove uh, the spot on my ear that I have up there. You guys will see that. To remove it, and then I'll be getting three injections every two weeks afterwards. And when I tell you guys those injections hurt... Oh my God, they hurt so bad. So I'm sitting up in there and I am afraid because I got all these big needles that was actually going in my ear. And that, guess what? It's no pain. I'm going to say no pain medication, no numbing, no whatever. They're going up in my ear and they're shooting all of these steroids in my ear and prepping my ear so that when they do the surgery, that my ear uh, does not uh, swell up or keloid or so again. Now, within my tummy tuck, now I'm finding out before my tummy tuck, I am going to have to go through the same thing. They're going to treat my skin again. I will be getting injections into my um, C-section area so that they can um, treat it with steroids so that it does not swell up. Yes, it does cost some money. Or I could just get the procedure. Or I could just be treated. So, I'm going to be injected for three weeks before the um, tummy tuck. Then I'll be injected... Uh, Every two weeks, three injections afterwards. I said three weeks, right? No, let me say this again. When I do my tummy tuck procedure, I will have three injections every two weeks into the area. Then I'll have the procedure. Then after the procedure, when I get healed some, I will actually get three more injections every two weeks after that, treating the area to make sure that the area is flat. So, right now, I am actually doing this. Then next... Um, I am within my tummy tuck. I have an area where I had my um, gallbladder removed, which is a small spot right there. This right here is going to be treated and uh, fixed as well. So I'm going through all of that. And so some of you guys have seen where I said that my body project starts now. It actually has started now. Yes, and I'm growing my hair out. You guys see, I'm growing my hair out for um, for the winter, and then next summer I'm gonna cut this shit off again. But I tell y'all what, I just had a, those squat workouts makes you sweat. Oh my god, this shit! I was like, oh shit! And this is not a wig. I got I put on extensions. I um did a quick weave. 
And so, um, to my night shift crew, I ain't have not kept y'all up, you know what I'm saying? But I'll probably be doing more videos and everything. Um, well, I can't say I probably, yeah, I will be doing more videos because I'm doing a squat challenge and I'll be doing um, videos all throughout. So, um, what I'm eating uh, for this week is, um, I'm actually going to put some chicken on the grill. I'm going to grill some chicken because my brother-in-law, oh my God, he can cook his butt off. My sister is so spoiled. Um, he had did some lemon pepper chicken and then he did some other chicken that was on, on the grill. And then he got these, um, he's healthy, which is awesome. Um, and then he had the, um, the, um, shit, what kind of burger did I eat last night with flatbread? He had made, oh my God, they were so good, they were so good. Um, so, uh, oh yeah, that's, uh, my sister just, uh, my, not my sister, my daughter just told me the veggie burger. But anyway, it was so good. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I'm actually going to be switching mayo to the veganaise. I got to find it. I think some is in Walmart. Guys, try the veganaise mayo. It tastes just like mayo, but it's more healthy. It's more expensive. But, you know what I'm saying? When I say expensive, expensive is like, hey, you know, you might do a dollar or two more. It's worth it. Hey, it's worth it for me. Um, let's see what else uh, I want to talk about. Um, I said no, 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 um... No cardio. I'm going to try, try, try to have no cardio and just do these squats and weights for this whole month. Today is my son's birthday. He turned 20. I can't believe I have a 20-year-old. And uh, so no cardio. I'm doing my squats, my ear procedure. My apology for um, me not being uh, and posting in the group like how I was supposed to. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, somebody asked me, sent me a thing, said that they were doing squats already and that their legs were hurting. Um... Their hamstrings or your hamstrings are supposed to hurt. If you if you ain't feeling nothing, you know what I'm saying, then you're doing something wrong. You know what I'm saying? So make sure you guys get some pain aid, get some Epsom salt to soak if you guys need to. But keep going, do what you can do. You don't have to go as far down as I go. Um also somebody asked me about um uh, when I did the um did I have a real corset because I have done the training of my body for all these years. Yes, this is my corset. I don't pull this crap out of it. Here's my corset. I'm tell y'all about the corset one. I don't like that shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't like it because um this right here used to be sticking me and shit. I ain't like that. You know, uh uh and, mm -mm. so I tried the other one and the other one worked magic. I just no I didn't uh uh I didn't want this shit, this shit right here. I mean that shit hurt. So I tried the other one. The other one worked wonders, baby. I ain't saying this don't work because the shit do work. Yo, whoever wear it, y'all wear the shit. But um, I ain't finna kill myself with it. But uh, but they do damn work. Just have to be consistent. I'm just not consistent with this shit. Not this shit. Um, but the other ones, every day you better believe I got my ass up in there every day. I'm training my damn ways. Um, I did not do it this weekend. Um, I did not weigh in. Um, I'm kind of like not jumping on the scale. Uh, but oh, my clothes this weekend was fitting fly. What fitting fly? I mean, I love the way that my clothes are on my body. Love, 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 love that. And um, so I hope you guys are getting vitamins. You know what? I gotta show y'all something. Kiara, yeah. go get my vitamins out the car at the back seat right quick, please. The keys is right here on the counter. So, I hope this. Okay. The keys in there, I think the car lock. Anyway, it was hot down back at home. You guys know I'm right at the line, Florida, and all this stuff. Um, I went home for my aunt's 86th uh, birthday party and surprised family that I was coming in. None of them knew that I was coming in and surprised my sister and stuff again, which was awesome. Um, some of the girls was asking me, oh no, one girl said to me, um, about, I'm thinking about having the surgery you had, you know what I'm saying, because I want to get small. Just because, please guys, don't get a surgery because somebody else had it and they were successful or they are at a place where you think that you might want to be, because it's hard work. You got to put in the work. 
You got to put in the work in order to get the results that that person had. So it ain't just that I had the surgery. You know what I'm saying? People are like, how you do that? Hold it. How you do that? I'm just like Beyonce right now. Shit, I woke up like this. Hell, I ain't lying. I wake up like this every morning now. So shit. Yeah, I woke up like this. I'm sick and tired of it. How did you do that? How did you do that? Stop asking me that shit. You know what I'm saying? It's just that, you know, what did you do? Or some, Don't just like, you had the surgery and you think that. Damn, it's a quick fix. That shit is not quick at all. You, I'm going on over five years and I'm still trying to make this work. But anyway, it was down there in Florida. Y'all, I'm telling y'all how hot it was in Florida. My vitamins. I gotta go get some more vitamins. Check this shit. Look at my shit. Y'all see that? All of my vitamins. This is my C. Are melted. How hot the I I've got a look at that melted. See that? This is my vitamin C. All right, here's my other one, my omega three. Could y'all imagine when I damn went? I took I was going to get my vitamins out the car, and these are my multivitamins, right? Look at that. Completely melted. I looked at my sister, I said, what? Because when you walk out the door, it's hot as hell. I said, what the fuck? Look at my shit. She was like, get you a spoon. I ain't get no damn spoon. Look at... My vitamins melted. Come on. So, but anywho, that's what's going on with me. I will be accountable. Doing these squats. Trying to eat right. Trying to do no cardio. Loving the way that my body looking. Love the way that my clothes is fitting, growing out this damn hair. And I hope y'all want to pump up some asses, build y'all asses. Don't buy no asses. We don't buy, we build. Okay? We will be working on y'all asses every other month if we have to be doing a squat challenge. So, I am getting my body right for my body project so that uh, I can have my tummy tuck, you know, and removing all this excess skin that I have. Um, and still training as much as I can because I want my weight snatched you hear me I want it snatched and you know what he already ready to snatch it too it's so exciting like when you go in there to a doctor he's like I can't wait to get a hold of your waist I can't wait to get a hold of your body you know what I'm saying it's like I'm gonna show you what I can do I'm so a man that's confident in that and then I love um, what Dr. Booty said Diana I have mastered the tummy tuck what you know what I'm saying he said I have mastered that moving that port Giving it out the way, giving you that flat stomach, you ain't got to worry about seeing that. It'll be just like you don't have one. He said, I have mastered it. You know, so I am so excited about that. And welcome to my channel. Let's come back to my page and I'll be putting up more videos because I'm going to tell y'all the truth. You know what I'm saying? I'm at damn 17 minutes. I told y'all I got to stop making these damn um, long ass damn videos. Hey, if you're just not visiting, um, hit subscribe. Tell a friend about it. Hit subscribe. Join me on Instagram. My Instagram is also Black Candy, B L A K K A N D I. Join me on Twitter, B L A K K A N D I I. And I don't know about Facebook, because I'm damn, I'm screening all these Facebooks and shit. You know what I'm saying? People getting where they're trying to send me all kind of crap. But uh, I thank you all, my, you know, loyal and loving friends and all that stuff. And I thank all my haters. I thank, but thanks for the view, bitch. I thank you for you too. Um, you know, keep on damn viewing, ho. Uh, Whoever the fuck you are. But uh, other than that, welcome to my channel. I'll be seeing you guys a lot this week. You guys can inbox me some things you want to talk about. And I'm going to be talk telling y'all about some of this damn hair too. Um, about this hair. Damn makeup. My girl. Seeing y'all on her page. She did like day-to-day -day makeup looks or something like that. I seen that. This weekend, guys, I did not have a lot of internet connection. I was down like in the woods. I mean, in the deep woods. And then I would take pictures of family and I'd be able to upload photos and stuff like that whenever I could. It was, I had very little internet connection. So, I did not post like pictures of food. I think I did do my black bean burger. My veggie burger. I did that on Instagram. Make sure you guys join me on Instagram, okay? Tell me guys what, what y'all want me to talk about. How you exercising and all this stuff. And I'll be getting with you guys later. I gotta go watch Love and Hip Hop. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Um, the reunion. So, I love you guys. I'll talk to you guys all this week. I love you guys. Bye. Bye.